Hello and welcome to another instalment of tutorials for the Joomla blank template. Now this particular session uh, could actually be applied to any uh, Joomla template so it is not blank Joomla template specific though of course we're using that template to describe something that um, you'll always find useful changing the background color and or adding an image so we've got our uh, demo site up here and we said we've got a few module positions using the uh, the heights and widths uh, of the developer CSS there uh, and we want to add a background color so the first thing I'm going to do is open up Firebug and I'm going to go and find the body section. See, that's already highlighted. So if I highlight that body div, I can see that there is actually no background element to this div as yet. So we'll double click to add a new line and we'll make the background red. And it really is as simple as that. And you know what you have to do then? You have to grab your. CSS, go find line 291. We'll flip over to our Dreamweaver there, 291. Paste in our new CSS. Save him up. And a quick refresh. And of course, it's still there. Great looking site. Now, instead of a background color, uh, color I'd like to add an image. Well the first thing you gotta do is get yourself an image and so I've downloaded a couple of images and I've got those on my desktop and I'm gonna now need to upload them to the web server and you need to stick those into your Joomla install. Now you don't want to put them in the images folder, and this is this is the uh, images. This is the entire site uh, site here. You want to put them in your images folder. You actually want to put them in the images folder of your templates. So if we go get templates, we'll open him up. There's our blank Joomla template, and we see we have an images folder in there, and that's where you want to put your images. So we're going to take this, I've got these background images already downloaded, I'm going to put them, put that little fella into my images folder. I'm just going to copy the name of it and we'll show you how quickly it is to, number one, get this image into your live website. Number two, to preview different images and see what, I'll offer them up without having to um, code the CSS. Let's go back to our website. Now, I've already got this background CSS line here and I'm just going to use that to preview this image. Um, now this none line here that's what we're going to change to go and find the image and to add an image you simply got to use the syntax URL and then we open a bracket surrounded by those fellas and then we do dot dot forward slash images forward slash paste in your image close the inverted commas and the bracket and there you go we've got it in, in place so let's close that up and have a little look and because we've already had the CSS Created when we actually on the on the firebug, we just used the none that was there, repeated it with our background image, and and it's automatic there with all the correct stuff. Now the only th one thing I'm going to do, I'm going to just change that to transparent, and we're going to go take that and get it into our CSS. Quick refresh, check we've done that right, <clears throat> and there we go. Job done. You can change your background colors and you can change your background images 
very easily with Joomla and the blank Joomla template. Hope you enjoyed that. That's all for now. Stay tuned for lots more tutorials coming your way and happy templating.